Hello there kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Fallout 4. Now, when we left off, uh, we were on our way out of here, then I realized I missed something right over Hell here, yeah. which is kind of necessary. So kind of good things to pick up. So, I went back, obviously picked it up, now we're going to actually be on our way out. So, everything is already dealt with down here. So, we're going to make our way out this way, through the Walden Pond gift shop door. And that was about as far as my brain went <laughs> in the planning stages, because the new DLC came out, and I have no idea if I'm going to be the appropriate level for it. So, <laughs> here we go. We'll find out in a moment. There we go. Whoop. Whoa, okay. I ended up being right in front of a counter for some reason. That was really weird. Alright, so basically, if we're... What the fuck do? Oh. Well, there we go. <laughs> uh, that was a noise that was a little disturbing to hear. But yeah, on the off chance, in the off chance that... We can't do anything with it. We'll just proceed as normal. But for the time being, we're going to run as if we are able to do it. Take everything we can out of this little area. Because why not? It's basically built just to take it. Just want to make sure I'm not accidentally setting off traps. Because we've already seen like two thus far. Ooh, can open this up. And if we can't mess with the DLC in these particular next few episodes, then we can't. It's just how it goes. I'm pretty sure Sweet. they, in some regard, require a pretty big level jump. Ooh. I'm happy I caught that before Dogmeat sets traps off running around like a doof. Dog, I love you. Dogmeat, I love you, but you are just really, really too ecstatic about running around. <laughs> Gonna kill me one of these days. Okay. What do we got going on here? That's a fishing rod. Don't need that. Just making sure I'm grabbing everything that's useful to me. Just the main issue usually that I forget to do. And I think... Yeah, we're good. We're good here. Now, where the fuck am I? <laughs> that's, that's the question here. Um, I had to have been around, yeah, this area. Automated tour. Hello, and welcome to Walden Pond. What the shit? What in the shit? Winter jacket and jeans. Okay. Got bourbon. I'll take that for damn sure. Hello, and welcome to Walden Pond. Okay, that's it? You so are you're gonna... now standing oh. in front of the cabin inhabited by transcendentalist writer and philosopher, Henry David Thoreau, mm -hmm. starting in the summer of 1845. Okay, two then. years, two months, and two days, Thoreau lived in this cabin, hoping to gain a more objective understanding of society. Did he succeed? This experiment was influenced by Thoreau's interest in transcendentalist philosophy, which believed that people were at their best when truly self-reliant. All right, fair enough. I can definitely understand that. By living off the land with few material possessions, Thoreau proved it skeptical to think that any outward improvement of life could bring inner peace and contentment. Hmm. For more information, please visit the gift shop and purchase one of the many books on transcendentalism. Um. Also available, t-shirts, copy mugs, toys, and many other items to commemorate your trip. I, I think you missed the point by... Thank you for visiting Walden Pond, sponsored by General Atomics, maker of the Mr. Handy robotic assistant. Oh, dear God. You missed the point by about... From here to the Capital Wasteland. That's how much you missed the point. Holy shit. 
Oh my god, the irony. Someone did that on purpose and they were giggling while they were doing it. I swear, someone at Bethesda was giggling like a fucking child when they were making that. At least I hope they were. You feel good about yourself, whoever made that. Oh, shitty. Shit. Shit. Okay. Let's kill this thing. Can I hit you? It'd be nice if I could do that. Oh, geez. There we go. Oh, geez. Good lord. I, I didn't want the blood sack. I wanted the torso. It's easier to hit. There we go. Okay. Well, those are done. And I say again, do you feel good about yourself for all of that? Really? Uh, you should, because that was amazing. <laughs> oh, scavenger with a harness and a sea captain's hat. Okay, this was the location of some BDSM sort of thing going on, apparently. From the look of this. I'm just going to walk away for about a mile now, if I can. <laughs> okay. Alrighty then. Now, is there a thing on the radio, which is where we're supposed to listen to the thing? The thing that's going on for the DLC. I guess maybe it'll pop up when I hit the appropriate level. Probably going to take a while, though. Huh. I I recognize this area. The reason why I recognize this area is because I've seen it at least twice in my own personal file. And there's usually a certain enemy over here. I'm surprised it's not. At the same time, I'm happy it's not. Because I don't think I'm capable of beating said enemy. So... It's not this early on in the game. So thank you, game, for not spawning that particular enemy. That would kill me stone dead. Do, however, want these. Oh, damn it, it was only one. Really? Shit. Okay, well. I at least got one hub flower. So better than nothing. And... Yeah, I'm gonna see... What we got going on. Oberlin Station. Yeah, we still have to do that. I forgot. Uh, we have to head south for that. So this way we go. We continue on in our quest to head over to Oberlin Station. And unlock any little new things we can along the way. Because why not? Pretty much in the area. Okay. Got going on here. What the... What are you growling at, huh? What are you growling at? Ooh, get some ammo off of you. Thank you. And out of this, fusion cell. Nice. And I think that's about all I can get here. Yeah, that seems to be the case. Okay. Nope. Dog meat pushed me out of the way while I was trying to go at the door. Stupid dog. Okay. Wait a minute. Okay. That is a, uh, that's a bit of a thing that I do not want to go towards. Because that looks radioactive as shit. What the? The hell's going on here? We commit our friend, Blake, to the earth. Oh, boy. Ashes to ashes, dust to dust. May he find peace with the Lord. Amen. Would anyone like to say anything before we move on? Blake was a great guy. And an even better friend. He was taken from us too soon. He won't be forgotten. Blake, I hope you know how I felt about you. Even if I couldn't say it to your face. Now you're gone. It seems too late. But I love you. Marcus, do you have anything to say? This is stupid. People die every day. I don't understand why. Understand. God, why did it have to be him, huh? Why wasn't it me? I'm the asshole of the group. I'm the one had it coming, not him. Not Blake. I'm sorry, guys. I just... I miss him so much. We all miss him, Marcus. He was the best of all of us. Thanks, guys. <clears throat> I'm okay now. 
really I am. Okay. That's it. There's nothing else we can do now. Time to move on. Holy shit, I've never seen this sort of thing happen. I am in shock that I have never seen this happen before, huh? but... Um, Hi there. Yeah? It's nothing else? Just gonna sit here? Okay. I'm gonna let you have your uh, peace then. What in the hell's bells is going on over here? Oh, jeez. I'm not even five feet away from it. Jesus Christ. Okay. Well, that thing was a uh, thing I've never seen before. <laughs> and now this is a thing I've never seen before. And I'd rather explore it, but at the same time, I'd also rather not. But I have enough right away, so I think it would be a good idea maybe to see what's going on here. You found something, huh? What'd you find? Is it radiation? Because I found it too. Okay. Let's see what we got. What the? Oh! It's a ghoul named Bethany. Uh, overdue book. Okay, that's a cooking station. Should probably not stand here like I am. Probably. Key phrase. Let's talk to Bethany real quick. Uh, first I want to take all of this. Because, fuck it. I'm here. Uh, right away. There we go. Bethany. <clears throat> I can patch you up if you need it. For a small fee, of course. You hear Any anything? There, doctor? Not nothing. Sorry. Just trying to practice medicine. Nice to know. Not interested. <laughs> I think well. you're I think you're cheating people, at least unless they're ghouls, because they have to sit here in radiation while you are, you know, sitting here curing them. <laughs> I'm just gonna move now. I didn't expect this, and now I'm a little, uh, not wanting to stay here anymore. <laughs> that's the word. There we go. Uh, that's a, a factory that we can explore later. This is the thing I want to look at, because this and this, these are, this has a lot of lights, so that's one reason why I want to see it. Um, pop another one of these, and... What else do I have? I have a lot of weight on me, so I might as well look for my grilled rad stag. There we are. Just in case I need to carry more shit later. Alright. And we will continue on in this direction. And we'll check out that little building later. Uh, do I have anything going on here? Because this looks... Yep, this is a raider camp. Good. Yep. Federal ration stockpile. Oh, okay. This sounds like it would be a really cool place to loot. So no wonder that they have people down here already. Okay. What we got in here? Uh, right away in a hot plate. I'll take that. Thank you. And... Raider Psycho. Yep, there is a bunch of motherfuckers over here. Okay, let's see. Okay, that bird going off at the right there. That was a little weird. And can we... This guy! Damn it, I only got one shot off. Uh, oh, jeez. I probably should not be sitting so close to this now that I think about it. Can I free aim a little bit? Yep, that's going to be a problem. Yes, definitely going to be a problem. Move over here. Thank you. And maybe I can get a shot off. Nope. Okay. Well, I'm fucked. Maybe if I throw off a grenade. There we go. Oh, jeez. Jack dog. Oh, Oh, jeez, that's not working. Uh oh, great. There's another one of these. Okay, come on. Jeez, why am I here? 
There's so much going on. Uh, and I can't deal with all of it. It's too much. Okay. I am not high, le high enough level for this. Damn sure. Okay. Can I just kill this one? Thank you. Good lord. Ooh, light dog armor. I'll probably give that to dog meat. Eventually. Once I survive this. That would be wonderful. Uh, shit. What can I take? I have a feeling I want to take Psycho for the time being. That'll help me a little bit. What do I have for food-wise? That might do it. <laughs> okay, that was quite a lot of screaming. That's a uh, suit of power armor that he's wearing right now. Can I start doing damage to him? There we go. What the hell? Oh, that's another attack dog. Oh! Okay. Oh, jeez. <laughs> that was disturbing, but at the same time... You know, not necessary. Well, I got some of your power armor down. <laughs> He's just chasing my dog around. Is that all he was doing the entire time? Holy shit. Okay, I want to see what he's got when it comes to this armor. A uh, bunch of it's all T45, so... Doesn't do much better than what I currently got back at base. Yep, I'm not going to be able to hit that. Uh, what we got? A legendary raider over here? Uh, might be able to take out this uh, raider here. Uh, pop. Warning. Nope, that ended up not being enough of a target. This will work. There we go. Perfect. Can we get more shots than this guy? That's what I'm hoping to, because I want to loot this place. I've done enough bullshit for it at this point. Okay. I had a feeling that would blow up. I'm saying it only blew up now. <laughs> Instead of, you know, when I was right next to it still. Okay. Okay, more things are blowing up. I should probably back up now. Yep, this is not going to do well for me. Holy shit. That was a lot of explosion. Oh, that was the wrong button. Okay, this guy. <laughs> He's standing through the fire and flames at this point. And there we go. That barely did any damage. That sucked. Okay. Where'd he go? There he is. It's a Raider Psycho. That's a different Raider entirely. Okay. Let's try and take care of this guy a little bit more. There we go. And a little bit more cover. I had before when I was shooting at this thing. Come on. Let me kill you. Please. There we go. And this might be... Oh, that is a turret. Okay. Dog meat, you okay? Okay, bud? There you go, you're good. Okay. Grab that. Grab... Ooh. Hunter Raider left arm. Probably sell that for a decent amount. Take all of this. There we go. Thank you. I'm definitely looting this place after all of this shit. I definitely earned this. Okay. Take a couple shots at this machine gun turret. Can I please hit it more than once? Okay. For a fragmentation grenade. That didn't work. Shit. Fuck it up. Okay, you're just throwing more of those and it's just pissing me off. Anything else? Those lights are starting to piss me off, that's for sure. Okay. I can deal with this one at least. Oh, we've got one more person still shooting at me. 
in here? Or? Seems like it's in here. I can open this. Yeah, sure. Oh, and you're dead. Okay. All right, well, I cleared this out pretty well, I'd say. And I'd say we probably got a substantial amount of loot here. I can just run myself through. Ooh. I can go in there, definitely. Although there's probably a lot more raiders. Yeah, that'd be a thing. Well, so far so good, at least. I mean, I've cleared out this place. Could have gone so much worse than it did. So, I'm not going to complain too much. Uh, just making sure I can find... Okay. They're going to piss me off. Let's start taking out these lights one bit at a time. That'll make me feel better at the very least. And... Yep. There we go. And there we are. I think we are as good as it's going to get. Although I'm now out of grenades. Which is not good. At least for me. At least in my mind, that is not a good thing. And it sounds like there is a generator nearby. There it is. And here's a fusion core. Nice. Perfect. Okay. Well, I'm just going to loot around this place a little bit. See what we got. Maybe it's something good. Maybe it's not. I'll talk cocktails. At this point, I might as well carry them. Because they are more... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Plentiful. There we go. More plentiful than some of the other things around. So I might as well grab them for the time being. And use them instead of, you know, actually good things that I like. I would like to have more of, but I can't because I'm poor. I don't know where enough people are to buy them. Okay. Well, not yet. Key phrase. I know where they're people, but I just don't know how soon I can get this person to it. Well, let's check this. See what uh, this all has maybe it has the amount of stuff we can get memo oh we have a whole bunch of stuff here we'll do that in the next episode <laughs> i'm gonna end the episode here for right now actually now that i think about it we have gone on for quite a bit and i've been rambling like an idiot anyway thank you all so much for watching click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more and click the like button if you like this particular video and share and comment so we can bring more people into this community we can talk about the games we're playing together and i will see y'all in the next episode, this has been the one, the only, Stray Cat, playing games for you.